Hey Journey, this is Pastor Mark with your weekly announcements. Welcome, it's so good to have you tonight. Uh, it's a very special evening because Becky Day is going to be speaking. Yeah, give it up. That's right. I'm excited. I'm pumped. It's going to be awesome. All right. But just a couple of announcements before we get started. Number one, Winterfest is next weekend. Can you believe it? So if you don't have your money in, I need it or else uh, you're not going to go. If you don't pay, then you don't play. You know what I'm saying? So that's uh, going to be happening next Friday. We're going to be leaving here early, early, early. Uh, 8 o'clock. Uh, so uh, this weekend there's going to be a meeting for parents going to Winterfest and students as well. That's going to be here at 4 o'clock on Sunday at Tri-State Worship Center here. So make sure you tell your parents about that so they can be here, so they can ask questions. I'm going to have an itinerary. I'm going to be uh, telling them where we're staying uh, and all that stuff, when they should be here on Friday, when they're coming back on Sunday. So tell your parents that's what's going to be happening uh, this Sunday, 4 o'clock. Monday night is Bible study. I heard we had about 15 kids there last Monday. That's awesome. Uh, and then Sunday is, on Sunday morning is Sunday school at 9.30 morning worship at 10.30, then evening worship time is at 6 o'clock. Now I have something very special for you. I'm excited because my good friend, Sister Prudence Wigglesby, has decided to come by and teach us a little bit about etiquette and prudence. So without further, further ado, let me introduce to you one of my good friends, Miss Sister Prudence Wigglesby. My name is Sister Prudence Wigglesby, and this is How to Be Prudent. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Sister Prudence Wigglesby, but you can call me Sister Prudence Wigglesby. Today, we are going to discuss how to be prudent. What does it mean to be prudent, you might ask? It means to be respectful. It means to follow the rules. It means not to be crazy and act weird in the youth room. Okay? So the first thing that we're going to discuss in prudence with prudence is cleanliness in the youth room. thing we will be discussing today in cleanliness in the youth room is clean up after yourself in the kitchen. The second thing we will be discussing today in cleanliness in the youth room is don't drop stuff on the floor!
What is this? Do not just throw stuff on the ground. The third thing we will be discussing today on cleanliness in the youth room is no food or drink in the sanctuary. Kyle, how many times have I told you no food or drink in the sanctuary? This is Sister Prudence Wigglesby reminding you to be proper, be patient, and always be prudent.